In Lab 18.1, students learn that the properties of a solution can be altered. If we add solute to a solvent, the properties such as melting point or boiling point changes. Let's see what happens to the melting point of ice when salt is added to it. First, take two beakers and label one A and the other B. Fill both beakers with crushed ice until one-third full. Place a thermometer in each beaker and wait one minute. Measure the temperature of the crushed ice from each beaker and record your results in Table 1 for starting temperature. What do you think will happen when two spoonfuls of salt are added to the ice in beaker A only? Make your predictions before proceeding on with the next step. Now add two spoonfuls of salt to beaker A only. Stir the mixture with the plastic spoon. Measure the temperature of the crushed ice in beaker A and beaker B. Record your results in table 1. You should have noticed that the temperature decreased significantly for beaker A. What do you think will happen when two more spoonfuls of salt are added to the ice in beaker A only? Make your predictions again before proceeding on with the experiment. Add two more spoonfuls of salt to beaker A only. Stir the mixture with the plastic spoon and measure the temperature of the crushed ice in beaker A and beaker B. Record your results in Table 1. The temperature for beaker A decreased again significantly while beaker B decreased by a little bit or by nothing at all. Therefore, by adding salt to ice water, we have decreased the melting point of ice. And by adding more salt, we can lower the temperature of the ice-salt water mixture even more 